Welcome back guys and gals. All right, so we're looking at 1991, The Rocketeer. This is it from top, super glossy movie cards and stickers. No bubble gum, thankfully. Uh, this is the Walt Disney movie from 1991. It's kind of like, I want to say like the what they wanted to follow up Dick Tracy with, 1990, Disney did Dick Tracy. It's kind of an old, you know, 1920s, 30s, 40s, whatever, serial comic book or comic strip series. Rocketeers, same kind of thing. They're bringing back old properties, trying to recapitalize them, start them over again. A uh, decent movie directed by Joe Johnston. It was his second major uh, feature film after Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, which I watched the hell out of when I was a kid. Um, most recently, uh, big things he did, Joe Johnston directed Captain America, the first Avenger. So let's get these up. Let's start with a few packs. So these are eight glossy movie cards and one sticker per pack. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's just do eight to start off with. This is a movie that I remember a lot when it came out. Like I said, I remember the hype of it. Like I said, it's Disney's trying to make it something really big. Uh, I remember my granddad printing off a picture of the Rocketeer for me in color, and it was like the coolest thing because it was like 1991, and having a color printer at home was like rare, you know? I used to draw the Rocketeer a lot because I was really big into it, although I never saw the movie till like years and years later. All right. All right, it's got a red border. You got a Rocketeer on the front, Billy Connolly. Billy Connolly. Billy Campbell. I always, I always get Billy Connolly, Billy Crudup, and Billy Campbell confused. Especially Billy Crudup and, and Billy Campbell because they are both in movies with Jennifer Connolly. All right, I presume that's a Rocketeer or something that's just a leg. All right. There we go there. Paul Sorvino and Billy Campbell. And what would that say? Silence. I can barely read that. The font's weird. Sinclair is a Nazi. Well, who isn't these days? Danger on all sides. Cliff Seckard. The Club Invaded. God, I can't even read that font, man. Observatory Shootout. Feds to the Rescue. Dunked in the Duck Pond. A makeshift plan. One of the last things I remember seeing Billy Campbell in was uh, he was on that TV series called The Killing. That was originally on AMC, and then it got dropped, and AM, then uh, Netflix picked it up. It's a pretty good series. Kind of like twin. It's pretty much like any of the small town murder mysteries, based on I think a Swedish television series. Uh, I think he's only in the first season though. You got a red border. You got a foot. A rocketeer. See, I, these days, I doubt you can even do that. I doubt you could make cards or trading cards or anything that has like that swastika on it. Taking on the enemy. I can't read that. Amrose PVP body. That's Alan Arkin. Under police protection. Fitch and the feds. Facing the monster man. At Griffith Observatory because not enough movies are set there. The Feds Open Fire, Dunked in the Duck Pond. Do we have the same card? Or is that in that last set? Okay, it was in the last, the last pack. The 1920s and 30s and 40s are kind of like a, a series or a, a time period that I kind of enjoy. I don't know why. I don't like the cowboy western stuff, and I don't like the 50s, and I don't like the 60s, and I don't like the 70s. There's something about the 20s, the 30s, and the 40s I kind of dig. I think I would have done well there. Part of the Rocketeer logo, red border, Rocketeer on the front, helmeted hero, John Polito as spectacular rescue. You know, I might may not let me not read those. I've got to save Jenai at the Chinese theater. He's got the rocket pack. How come I haven't seen one Jennifer Connelly yet? Keep this guy alive. Him again. Speaking of which, him again. At the Bulldog Cafe. So this is a movie that I actually presented and projected on 35mm at one point in my uh, film projectionist career. I think it was back in 2014, 2015, something like that. I don't know exactly when. I could look up exactly when, but I don't think anybody cares that much. Dun, 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 dun. 
It's one of the few Jennifer Connelly movies I've shown on 35mm. I know I've shown that, and I've shown Labyrinth. And... Okay, out of the two. Uh, right Foot again, which we had already. Designing a Helmet. Slip Sliding Away. There we go. There's my girl. Jenny Blake. It's like the... Uh, God damn. No Way Out. If you look at the history of women that I've been attracted to and baby mamas and ex-girlfriends, they all pretty much... Dark hair, dark eyes. Occupational Hazard, because of her. Mid-air Death Struggle. Uh, James Bond. No, wait. Yeah, James Bond. Uh, Neville Sinclair. Danger on All Sides. Boom. I know I've seen the movie. I've projected the movie. I never actually owned it, although I bought a VHS of this within the past re in the recent weeks for my VHS channel. Rocketeer logo, one we just had. Uh, John Polito, who is in The Crow. There's another card series we've done, so you would have seen him in another card series as Gideon. Where's Cliff's Accord? The Knight of Flight. The Flying Fortress. High Flying Hero, whoever designed, whoever chose that font, I should have been fired. Emergency Escape at Chaplin Airfield, Lothar Triumphant. Probably the last time I would have seen this movie or even come close to seeing it is when I projected it. So it's been four or five years, perhaps even six. It's the third time I've got that same right foot. Jesus. Rocketeer. Pondering the Future, The Rocketeer, Up the Laundry Chute, Neville's Last Stand, America's Daredevil, News Travels Fast, and Blasting Off. I would have projected on 35mm other Jennifer Connelly movies, but they would have been like first run stuff plattered back in like 2000 to 2010 whatever she was in like blood diamond beautiful mind all that good stuff the whole our original hulk a rocketeer ready for action just you can barely even see anything on that that's a waste uh do, 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 do. cliff's gb his fury unleashed bigelow's bonanza there's a cute one the seduction a Gift from Howard, The Rocketeer's Plan, Hughes' Invention, is that, uh, what's his nut? Uh, John Locke from Lost. Mm -hmm. uh, Nazis in the News, when are they not? Alright, one more pack and we'll call this video over with. And this is a, how many times are going to get that same one? Oh, that's the other side, never mind. I spoke too soon. The Rocketeer, Red Border, Pummeling PV, Knitted by Neville, His Back Broken, Down But Far From Out, A Hero Once Again, Eddie Valentine, what was the name of the character in uh, Roger Rabbit? Was it Eddie something? It wasn't Valentine, was it? The uh, future looks bright, JJ, J Con, and the Rocketeer. That looks like the number one card. Yep, number one card. What is what was the character, main character's name in Roger Rabbit? Eddie something. It wasn't Valentine though. It sounds close. All right, it's gonna be it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, dislike, unshare, unsubscribe, whatever. It's all the same to me. Thanks for watching, guys. Next time.